Hey everyone, it's Michelle Rojas. Over this last week, I got announced for a couple of voice roles, so I guess I should talk about that. The first one is for an anime called Citrus. This one has been anticipated because it's supposed to be a really good girls romance show. There aren't a ton of series that come out that have a lesbian couple as the main focus, so it's really cool to have one this season. The girl that I play is Kana, and she's one of Yuzu's old friends. We get to see Kana and their other friend Manami in the first episode, right before Yuzu leaves to go to the new school. Since she did change towns, we're not going to see them again for a while, but they should be coming back after a little while. The other role I was announced for is in Basilisk Oka. I play a little boy named Shikibu, who's one of the kids in training. Not a whole lot is known about the kids yet. These are new characters for this series, but from the latest Japanese episode, it looks like they're starting to turn their focus to the kids. So hopefully soon we'll get to learn a little bit more about them. So each of the kids have a little thing about them that makes them unique. One of the kids that really stands out to me is the one with a gun because it's a ninja with a gun. And there's another one that has like a magical scarf. But the kid that I play, Shikibu, he actually has a disadvantage. So you'll notice on his character artwork, he actually wears a headgear. And it's harder to tell, but he also has armor on. It's brought up in the show that the other kids think that this isn't fair. But what's actually happening is Shikibu can't take any of this armor off off. He wears it because he has a medical condition. I don't know that they've clarified exactly what it is, but it's something with his muscles. And all we really know is that if he takes off the armor, he could potentially die. So he doesn't look like the coolest kid. He doesn't get a gun or a magical scarf, but he's actually pretty awesome. He still chose to become a ninja, even though he's at such a drastic disadvantage from the others. I think it shows that he has a lot of determination and is willing to take the risks that he needs to take. I'll do my best to bring out all of those qualities that I really believe he has. Tomorrow, Kristen, the director for Citrus, is having a watch party with the actresses. So I'll be attending that, and I think that she might stream it? And after we watch the episode, we'll be doing a Q&A. She is taking those questions ahead of time, so we can go ahead and have them ready. So if you want to submit a question to that, you can tweet her at Chris Comics. I'll leave a link in the description as well. Well, that's it for me. So as always, thank you for watching, and see you tomorrow.